but I think, I think, I'm not too sure, but I think I may have been the first comedy reaction channel on YouTube. I think so. Because I don't remember, because I think that's why I started talking about Because I don't remember, I can't remember if there was another channel on YouTube that was speaking about the comedy scene and like reacting to it. I don't think it existed. I'm not too sure if I'm right or wrong, but I think I might have been the first person to have done it on YouTube at the time. I think that's might have helped me get that bit of a bump. And then everyone just started doing their own version of shit, right? Which is fucking cool. It's amazing how there's, there's, there's this whole ecosystem that exists now. But I think I might have been the first person to kind of do React stuff on there. I don't know if I'm right. I could be wrong, right? This could be a Kanye moment, <laughs> right? But it could be one. Um... Uh, duh, duh, duh. these people are addicted to more than anything to attention exactly Uche. it's a drug so when they go back to their uh, to their rat race they can't comp cope with the feeling of relevant no true i think you see that a lot with wings of redemption wings of actually let me end this poll um okay most of you guys don't give a fuck and five percent said house phone and 22 percent said um the fan so yeah you will agree with me um Uche is right there i think i saw a lot with wings of redemption Wings Redemption gets trolled so often by people online and it got to a point where I think last year or I don't know how long ago it was, but essentially it got to a point where people were like, hey, why don't you just like quit and get a regular job? You don't need this hassle. And he basically said, no, I want to keep streaming because it's the only place where I feel relevant. Like, I don't feel like I matter in regular life because I'm a fat, lazy dude. So when I get on stream, I'm, you know, people care about me. They follow my streams. Even if they come into hate, they're logging in, they're watching me and shit. It gives me a sense of like, uh validation i feel needed wanted whatever it was kind of depressing but also incredibly honest um i did cool stuff 10 years ago i can't think of papa hitting on annie and kalala uh, for uh finding az i was a fan of the trash shooter back then but it was a bitch to get slapped i can't breathe again sacristina <laughs> <Whoa, Sacristina. laughs> um red bar yeah cool okay kilo you're right maybe me and red bar but i don't I, I i don't remember red Bar. like i only found out red bar because i started doing my stuff and people would comment on my stuff and say hey you're like red bar you're like the black red bar i didn't even know who red bar was so i found out about red bar through what i was doing so maybe i yeah maybe i can't take that maybe red bar was doing it but he's not on youtube so i think i might have been the first person on youtube to do that whole shit and um, because i remember just thinking that why doesn't this exist like why is this is it i don't know so um Da, 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 was a uh, Brendan Shub is a job yeah Brendan Shub's a job creator <laughs> he actually is there's people I think who Joke World probably I'd say who's probably full time doing this shit who's who's probably full time Joke World so to try probably is full time Comedy Enforcement we say he's full time I think he is even though you guys don't like him I think Comedy Enforcement is probably full time is Unique full time from just YouTube Unique I'd say he is, but you know, if you drink a lot, it's not gonna that money's not gonna go far. And who else is full time? Hmm. I can't think of many. What are you guys saying in the chat? Who else would be who else do you think is full time? Because some you know, Casey said here, Dren Job is a job creator. Who do you think has got a full time job from talking shit about comedians and Brendan and shit? Um Robert Henry Poet said, I guess, you know, you were definitely the first person I saw covering Brendan and I think Base Frequency was the second one I noticed. Yeah, exactly. That was around up there because I remember those documentary channels popping up at the same time but that one person just talking about stuff, it was like, there wasn't a lot but now there's many of them. Who do you think is full-time? <laughs> Z, full-time wasted. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Dicey, Dicey, yeah, for sure, is full-time. Um, Unique, no more live. Really? Why doesn't why does Unique do any more lives, Jared Miller? Do you know why? Is, is he, did he get banned from doing lives or why? He should do more lives. Why doesn't Brendan? Why does he do more lives? The first report, okay. <laughs> yeah, the first report on the site documented the car crash. Exactly. <laughs> You're a pioneer. No, no, I'm not, I'm not a pioneer. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to say I'm a pioneer. I'm just saying I probably was the first person to do it. It doesn't mean I'm the pioneer. I'm just someone just talking shit here, man. Let's not. Let's not. Let's not make this bigger than what it is. Because it's actually it's actually kind of redacted for me to even mention that, to be fair. I'm not going to lie. It kind of is redacted and it makes me look fucking insane that I'm actually even mentioning it and taking any credit for it. It's absolutely ridiculous. But it is what it is. Um, unique, no more live. Why is it Unique doing more lives? I came around for Chris D'Elia. No one's donating. Is that why he's not doing live anymore? Retroactive makes a decent amount for Papa content. Yep, for sure. Wow. If Unique doesn't do any more lives, that's crazy. 
So Uni doesn't do new lives because of lack of donations. I'm surprised. Okay. Yeah, the T Fat K guy, as much as the Reddit hates him, he's fucking balling. He's balling for sure. As long as he's not getting, you know, um, he's not getting the yellow fucking, de you know, limited ads on his shit. He's balling for sure. He's balling. Um, you definitely introduced me to Papa, but I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> exactly, young old times. Exactly. I'm sorry. <laughs> Lo siento. <laughs> Forgive me. You know, bean cheese, bean cheese, bean cheese, bean cheese. Forgive me. <laughs> oh, I found out the T the T Fat K's old channels. Yeah. I've heard a lot. I've heard a lot about. I've heard a lot. A lot about that. I've heard a lot about that, and I don't know what to say, man. I don't know what to say. Um, I'll just kind of keep my mouth shut. It's none of my business. It's above my pay grade. Um, let's move on from that.